Every kid should have fun at some point in their life, and a lot of these kids don't because they're, you know, they're always with a coach or uh, like a one-on-one -on -one therapist, and they're always analyzing them and you know, kind of treating them, you know, not like a normal kid. Uh, so this is more of like just a recreational go have fun, and you're not judged when you're here. No one's looking at you. Just come here, have fun like every other kid. As a paid employee or a volunteer, you need, to, you need to be passionate, you need to be accepting, you need to be able to be loving, you need to be able to not take anything personal, you need to be able to adapt because they could be tired just like anybody else, tired, and we all have our shining moments and our not shining moments, so we need to not take anything personal and be adaptable and be accepting and willing to have our bad days and our good days and go with it. We've definitely done a tremendous job, the entire staff, as far as just developing uh, our relationship with the children. So in the future, I would love to uh, see these children develop, uh, you know, not only in our program through uh, the various program and age-appropriate programs that we have here. As we keep getting older, the programs will continue to advance. Ready? Oh, oh no, one first. First day, second day, third day. He's safe. Oh, yeah. Good job. So every year it seems like they change up the program a little bit, they get more volunteers, more kids show up. Um, so a couple years back I decided that uh, you know I wanted to get more involved, so I'm on the board of directors and um, we started doing that, we started getting more involved in the fundraisers. Um, and we just keep coming back because the kids love it. You know, the goal in, in, in the years to come, we're hoping to reach many kids and branch out, maybe go out on the island into the city, because you know, as the numbers increase with kids, there's just a real need for these type of programs. This place lets the children feel included. You know, like you, you want your kids to do sports, you want your kids to have fun and play around. He would need a lot of attention, he would need a lot of help, and it takes away time from the other kids. With this place, there's so many volunteers here that you don't take away attention from anyone. I think it's due to the activity level when they come in here on Saturday, they have a lot of fun in what they're doing and it sort of carries over to the home environment. You know, this is a, an inexpensive option for your kids to come and have fun with people that you trust. Kids with special needs should not be treated differently than anyone else and you can relate to them and you can be a part of their lives in a very meaningful way. I really wish that you know we could uh, you know really bring ourselves up, get ourselves to the next level, and I think that we're very close to doing that. But I really want to get the word out that be the best sport exists, and we want to do more, and we want to help as many kids as possible.